this is Mad Wilkes and I'm Mad Wilkes and Tarot. It is Thursday, October the 28th, 2021. Tried to go to Boo at the Zoo tonight, but they were sold out. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. Glad to have you. If you are a long-term subscriber, I thank you for your continued support. If you have not already done so, could you please like, share, and subscribe? Thank you. Hello, Cancer. How are you doing today? I hope you're doing well. I hope you're taking care of yourself and the people around you and vice versa. I hope you know you're beautiful, you're gorgeous, and you have that beautiful star shining bright inside of you. This is a general reading. It will not resonate with every cancer out there. Take what does and leave the rest. And there's no gender in tarot. Cutting the deck for cancer. Spirit. The Queen of Wands. Wands are fire energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. The Queen of Wands, the Queen of Passion. She's good looking, charismatic, fun to be with, sexy and exciting. What is crossing this? The Strength. This is Leo energy. The Strength talks about taming the beast inside. It could talk about lust, especially with the Queen of Wands. And having the strength to get through things that are challenging in your life. Consciously known, the tower, the tower, the tower is a cataclysmic change that you cannot prepare for. The tower has to fall because it was not built on a firm foundation. Source spirit universe had to strike the tower down. After the tower has fallen, you can rebuild on a firm foundation this time. Unconscious. Six of pentacles. Pentacles are Earth Energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I like the skull pendulum. This talks about needing equal give and take in a relationship. Recent past. The Wheel of Fortune. The wheel is spinning in an upward direction for you. Um, I like this. It's This is a good luck omen. This means success. The wheel is spinning in an upward direction for you. Near future. The High Priestess. The High Priestess. High Priestess is Divine Feminine. She's independent. She sits in her throne. She sits in her power. Um, she knows her worth. She's empathic. She's intuitive. She knows how to figure people out. She has a scepter, a book, candles. Um, in some decks, she's got a crystal ball, tarot cards, a black cat. Kind of a witchy vibe here. The High Priestess. Where do you find yourself? Knight of Swords. Swords are air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. The Knight of Swords. Swords are all about honest, clear communication. So the Knight of Swords needs clear, honest communication, or he will use that sword to cut you right out of his life. He is a younger energy than the King or Queen, less mature, so can come off as bra brash, abrasive, blunt, and has a tendency to rush in and out of your life. Not a very consistent energy. External influences. The chariot. This is my car card. Maybe chopping for a car. Uh, this also talks about moving forward and a uh, fork in the road, and you need to choose a direction. Moving forward, choosing a path. Cancer energy. Hopes and or fears. Seven of Wands. Wands are fire energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Seven of Wands talks about overcoming obstacles. A lot of things have been coming your way, but you have had the strength to fight through each and every obstacle. Using your strength. Overall outcome. The Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Money. Pentacles are Earth energy. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. The queen of money. She's got a money money sack right there. She's a business person, ground to balance, stable, makes her own money, takes care of her money. Bottom of the deck, the four of pentacles. Pentacles are earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This can talk about holding on to someone with your heart chakra or someone holding on to you with their heart chakra. could also talk about um, 
Saving more than you spend just watching your money. Not spending frivolously. Eight of swords. Eight of swords. Someone's got you all fucked up in your head. You think that you're in backed into a corner, you think you're bound, you think you're stuck, but you are not. This is your mind playing tricks on you. You're not bound, you're not stuck, you're not painted into a corner. Just your mind playing tricks on you. Ooh, the star! Look at that, Aquarius energy. The star, this is the angel card, this is the wish card. What are you wishing for? Cancer. I love to see the star. Angel card, wish card. Aquarius energy. <gasps> Two of cups. Soulmates. Look at that. Soulmates. Cups are water energy. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. They got hearts for eyes and nose. The water is spilling from his cup into her cup. Their beautiful bright red hearts are shining right through their rib cages. Soulmates. Lo lovers. Divine counterparts. Whatever you want to call them. Nine of Swords. Swords are air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is also being all up in your head. This is sleepless nights. This is dreams. Um, wonder what you could have, should have, would have done differently if you could. Must be past energy if you got the star and the two cups right there. See what Doreen has to say. Retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. I'm surprised the hermit didn't show up. Maybe it still will. Unrequited love. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. Collect. You are blessed. You are blessed. Regeneration. And orphaned. I've got my Nastra Nostradamus major arcana right here gonna throw some major a uh, couple of majors on this the papist the high priestess again the high priestess she is uh she's strong she's independent she sits in her power she knows her worth she's empathic she's intuitive got kind of a witchy vibe black cat crystal ball bottom of the deck the hangman the hangman the hangman talks about meditation spirituality being caught between a rock and a hard place dark night of the soul and although you can't see it as well in this card but sometimes you need to look at things from a different perspective in order to figure them out so we had the queen of passion we had the strength card you want equal give and take wheel spinning in an upward direction the high priestess chariot moving forward overcoming obstacles the queen of money watching your money taking care of it the star the lovers soulmates and we had a tower here and we had you thinking you're all bound bound up in a corner and sleepless nights and maybe it's this ice night i don't know retreat take some time to yourself that's good unrequited love i think this is past energy and love yourself first your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. Blessed. Regeneration. And orphaned. Maybe you're feeling alone at this moment. And we had the high priestess. And the hangman. 
So let's start with the star, soulmates, queen of passion, the strength, equal give and take, wheel spinning in an upward direction, the high priestess twice, moving forward, queen of money, the high priestess again, and the, the hangman. All right, Cancer, have a great evening. Um, I will speak to you soon. This is Amanda Wilson of Amanda Wilson Tarot. Bye for now.